Okay, so moving on to question number 12, I believe. How many moles of sodium bicarbonate are in 580 grams of sodium bicarbonate? So I'm going to write down that our mass is 580 grams. And I need to solve for number of moles. So let's recall that uh, the main formula to solve for moles when you're given mass is number of moles is equal to mass over molar mass. So the question doesn't give us the molar mass of sodium bicarbonate, but lucky for us, it is easy to calculate. So I'll break it up into two steps. For molar mass of sodium bicarbonate, we need to find the different atomic masses for each of these atoms. So these are the values you would just find on your periodic table. So its molar mass is equal to the molar mass of sodium plus the molar mass of hydrogen plus the molar mass of carbon plus three times the molar mass of oxygen. And this is because there are three atoms of oxygen and sodium bicarbonate. So now I'm just going to plug in their different atomic weights. For sodium, it's 22.99 grams per mole. Hydrogen is 1.01 grams per mole. Carbons is 12.01 grams per mole. And then I'm going to do 3 times the molar mass of oxygen, which is around 16 grams per mole. So if I were to add up all these different values, I would get a total molar mass of 84.01 grams per mole. So the second part of this answer, I need to solve for the number of moles of sodium bicarbonate in 580 grams of the sample. So now I can do number of moles equals mass over molar mass. The mass was given in the questions, 580 grams. And the molar mass is what we calculated in the previous step. 84.01 grams per mole. You'll notice that our units for grams should cancel out and moles should go from the denominator to the numerator and we end up getting a final value of 6.90 moles. Okay, so let's see what our junior tutor said. To solve this, we must recall that to convert mass to moles, we use the molar mass. The molar mass of a substance is the sum of the molar masses of all atoms in the substance. The molar mass of sodium bicarbonate is 84.006 grams per mole, and the calculation of the moles is shown below. 580 divided by 84.006 gives you 6.90. Okay, so this solution is correct.